What the fuck is Project 2025? If you haven't heard yet, recently there have been rumblings about something called Project 2025. Their website says that it's a plan to reshape the federal government to support the agenda of Donald. I know what you're thinking. Felicia, any group of guys can get together and create a PDF. Yeah, this isn't that. Let me tell you about the organization that put this PDF together. You tell me if you think it's something that we should have raised eyebrows about. Project 2025 is the latest work from the Heritage Foundation, a conservative organization founded in the 70s whose policies were literally implemented by Reagan. Back then, they published a plan named Mandate for Leadership, and 60% of the proposals in this plan were actually implemented. And they've been infiltrating our policies ever since. Yeah, former VP Mike Pence said himself that the Heritage Foundation played a pivotal role in advancing the conservative policies during the Trump administration. Heritage Foundation creates the blueprint. They publish it, then a conservative president just does what the book says. Project 2025 is the next book that outlines what should be done in the event that a Republican president gets in office next year. I got my hands on it. This thing is 900 pages long. According to the plan, there would be a swift takeover which would give the president absolute power. Everything is focused on the president's agenda. Navigating the media to make sure that it aligns with the president's agenda. Removing positions if they don't align with the president's agenda. You cannot have your own opinion here. <laughs> and it only gets crazier from there. Like they want to eliminate funding for diversity, equity, and inclusion practices. Abolish diversity, equity, and inclusion offices and staff. Eliminate the chief diversity officer position. They also want to eliminate the interagency working group on the social cost of carbon. carbon. Oh, that's only the agency that ensures that regulations reflect the best available science. And speaking of science, they want to make sure that the dietary guidelines focus on nutritional issues and don't veer off mission by focusing on unrelated things such as the environment. Proactively defend agriculture, aka denounce climate change. Oh, and by the way, the Department of Education should be eliminated, apparently. Also, they want to dismantle the Department of Homeland Security and eliminate any offices within the FBI that it has the power to eliminate without any action from Congress. And even though all of that is wild, the wildest thing to me is something that I actually don't understand, something I have a question about. On page 13, they mention that all of this is organized into four pillars. And the fourth pillar is something that hasn't been completed yet. It says that they are forming agency teams and drafting up transitional plans to move out upon the president's utterance of the phrase, so help me God. What does that mean? Anyone understand what that means? Can someone get in the comments and interpret that for me? What do you think that means?